biggest problem with um, ukulele building is making thin parallel sided sections like this. This is um, a bit of driftwood that came up off the beach and it's quite a nice quality uh, mahogany of some sort. Uh, basically I've turned in wood this cylinder just a little bit wider than the section of what I'm using, mounted it on an arbor um, and then with everything running sanded the outside of it flat to make sure that it, there's no eccentric movement um, and then I've taken it off glued it with a um, uh, very very strong wood adhesive and then dipped it in um, carborundum grit and so basically I've got a round piece of sandpaper spinning it about uh, I think this is 1420 of this engine so it's uh, 2800 rpm and it's about two and a half inches diameter um, push your wood in one side and out the other side uh, I'll run it up and show you There, just to show you, uh, we're not quite flat there, there's a few little uh, low spots, but as soon as it's got gone flat and I've lost all the machining marks, I don't know if you can, yeah, you can just see the machining marks across there, once they've gone, then I'll uh, turn it over and do the other side. I'll generally put it through one way, then back through the other way, just to make up for any uh, inaccuracy in the in the levelling of the device but it's getting nice and flexible now and should should hold a, a set once it's been steamed or put on a former